Hi everyone, Jason from Make Carry here with another Carvera how-to, and in this one we're looking at how to apply a UV solder mask on our PCBs. A PCB or printed circuit board is a crucial component of nearly every device and appliance that we own. And with the Carvera and the optional PCB fabrication pack, we can create and manufacture our own custom PCBs. A UV solder mask is not always required when making a PCB, but it does allow for a higher quality finish to be achieved, allowing for us to make professional grade PCB prototypes. To apply a solder mask, we first must machine our traces onto a PCB blank, but then leave the PCB in the Carvera and and move the tool head out of the way. You should also always wear gloves as you should not handle uncured mask with your bare hands. It's best to apply multiple thin coats of the UV mask using the roller rather than a single coat. In between coats, use the UV curing lamp which can be powered via the side USB charging port on the Carvera to cure each mask layer. Typically, two to three layers should provide an effective solder mask. And a mask layer should cure in approximately 15 minutes, but that time will vary based on how thick of a coat you apply. Any excess UV mask on the roller or clamps can be cleaned with alcohol wipes. Once the UV solder mask has been applied, we can use the UV solder mask removal tool from the PC fabrication pack to finish our PCBs. Using the Carvera controller, we wanna send the through holes, pads, and edge cuts for our PCB to be machined. You want to ensure that you do not change your work origin and you shouldn't need to adjust the Z height or auto leveling if that was set in your first PCB file with all of your traces. Using the solder mask removal tool, mask is machined away on the pads and contact points where we need to solder our components. We can also use the laser engraving module to remove solder mask and create an etched silkscreen layer which allows for us to make professional quality PCBs with the Carvera. And to prepare your manufacturing G-code files for your PCBs, the Carvera is compatible with a wide range of cam solutions, including flat cam and copper cam. But we recommend using Makecara Cam as it's optimized for importing and preparing Gerber files for the Carvera, as well as working with the laser engraving module and all of the bits included in the PCB fabrication pack. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for future projects, how-tos, and guides on the Makecara channel.